What's going on guys this is me Mehdi Shakil and you are watching it's a stack tutorial. So guys in this video I'm going to show you that how you can optimize your Windows 11 computer by disabling some of the system feature, debloating some of the application and many more. So without further ado let's get into the video. So guys right now you can see my computer screen and I am using Windows 11. If I open my run and type here winvar and press enter here you can see right now I'm using Windows 11 version 23 H2. Now let me show you how you can debloat your Windows 11 operating system. And to debloat and optimize our Windows 11, we are going to use an application called RayTuneX. You can easily download it from Microsoft Store, from the GitHub, or also from the WinGet option. So let me show you how you can get that application. So first of all, open up any of your browser, then search on Google RayTuneX GitHub. Then go to this first link and this is the application RayTuneX that can help you to optimize and debloat your Windows 11 operating system. Here you can see the installation methods. You can use winget command to install using the terminal and also you can get the latest zip file to install it. Just click on this release option then scroll down and from using this zip file you can download it or also you can use this exe file. Let me show you how to install it from the winget. So for this you have to copy this command. Winget install rate unix. Then click on start and open up your terminal. Then paste that command here. Then press enter. Now this command is going to install the rate unix on your computer. If it asks you do you agree to all the source agreement terms, press y then press enter. Here you can see it's downloading from the same GitHub repository. Here is the exe file. After downloading, it will execute that exe file to install it on our Windows 11 computer. Here you can see it's starting package installation. It also gonna take some time, so you have to wait. Okay, so here you can see successfully installed. Now you can close your terminal. Now click on start and search for Red Unix. Here is the application. Open it. Okay, so guys, here you can see the Red Unix application interface. First of all, it will ask you to set up a restore point. I also recommend it to do it. So click on continue. Because if during the optimization, your computer will get stuck or crashed, you can use this restore point to restore your computer. So click on OK. OK. Now here you can see the menu of Red Unix. The welcome screen, optimize, repair, debloat, privacy, feature and many others. First of all, I'm going to click on settings and change the UI to dark mode. Also from here, you can check the updates of the Red Unix. Click on check for updates and you will check for updates. Here you can see we have currently the latest version installed on our computer. Now let's go through the menu. Let's click on optimize. Now here you will get just simple toggle option to optimize your Windows 11 computer. You have to read all of this option and read the description to understand what you are going to do. Here you can see it shows disable menu show delay. I'm gonna on it. Disable mouse over time. I'm gonna on it. So do not just toggle on all of this feature. Read all of this and understand all of this. Then turn on. If you didn't get understand any of this feature, just keep it at default. I'm gonna disable crash dump, disable remote assistance, disable Windows sec. I'm gonna add a new menu to my context menu. And from the advanced system optimization, I'm going to disable unnecessary service, optimize system profile, enable GPU priority settings, disable stored update, automatic update. I'm going to optimize all of this feature. Also, you can go through every feature if you want. Then go to repair section. If you have any problem with your disk, you can use this DSM, SFC, CHK disk option to repair your computer. Then I'm going to click on debloat. And from this debloat menu, I'm going to Disable or uninstall some of the Microsoft built-in application what we did not require to run our Windows operating system. Let's say I'm going to delete this Microsoft OneDrive, then scroll down. Cortana, Bing News, Bing Search, Bing Weather, Copilot, Edge, Gaming App, Microsoft Get Help. Then after selecting the application, whatever you want to remove or debloat from your Windows, just click on uninstall selected apps. Then click on continue and now after some time it will remove or debloat all the application from your Microsoft Windows. 
here you can see it's showing us installing the application then you can go to privacy setting and from here you can select your privacy setting like i'm going to disable advertising id disable news and interest spotlight feature cloud optimization content feedback notification is telemetry scroll down disable find my device disable clipboard sync like this you can switch between your privacy settings so guys like this using this application ready next you can optimize and deploy your windows 11 operating step so that's all for today thanks for watching